Well, we made it to the cemetery. I literally just missed everybody, but I caught one person, Shimei. Uh, so Shimei is in front of me. She's bringing me to uh, Dave's grave, and uh, she said they brought Karachi, and um, I'm here at the cemetery, and I'm gonna show you guys Dave's grave um, and his final resting place. So I bet you that's, that's probably it right there. Um, Hey everybody, the germ here at Cold Spring Cemetery down here in uh, South Jersey, Cape May, New Jersey. Um, as you guys know, uh, we lost a dear friend on uh, December 27, 2021, uh, Camel Dave, Dave Hughes, a uh, YouTube creator. Um, I know a lot of you couldn't make it down here for the services and I wanted to make sure that uh, you guys were able to pay your respects through one of my videos. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and bring you over to the grave. One of the things that's very interesting here is if any of you guys have been following me for a while is two years ago, I actually did a live stream in this cemetery. Um, I knew Dave's mom and dad were both buried here in the cemetery and I did a live stream here. I couldn't find it. He didn't tell me their names. He kind of didn't answer that question. Um, but there are a lot of hues in this uh, cemetery. And currently we're nowhere near that um, Dave's grave. Um, but he would tell me about Captain, uh, Captain Hughes and I remember coming over here and vlogging all this and not knowing that I would be here probably about two years later doing this all over again. You know, it's kind of crazy. I have family of myself, uh, of my own, that is also buried in the cemetery. Now, this is not Dave's grave. Um, it's not a relative as far as we know for Dave, but uh, we used to often joke around about it. Not a small cemetery, but not a really huge cemetery. It's not overwhelming, uh, but you guys can kind of see um, diagonal from us all the way back, probably a good quarter to a third of a mile. That's where uh, Dave's grave is going to be. So we're going to go over there now and I'll show you guys where that is. So you know where it is when you guys come to visit, pay your respects if you're in the New Jersey area. Now, my intentions were to be here for the services for Dave, and uh, unfortunately, because of uh, uncontrollable circumstances, I actually lost my car keys. Um, I was 45 minutes late, and I literally just missed the whole entire thing. Um, I did run into Shimei, and uh, we had, God, we were talking for a good 45 minutes and catching up and uh, talking about uh, Dave and reminiscing about times. Um, she had a two hour drive home, so she went back and drove home, but she was nice enough um, to show me where it was. And I got really lucky because Shemay said that literally everybody just left. And as I was pulling in, she was pulling out. Um, she was kind enough to turn back around and show me uh, where the grave is. So I now know where it is to show you guys. And I got Camo Dave's duck with me that he gave me. All right, we're gonna turn over here. And it's not down this row, but we're getting there. Now I spoke to Shimei and Shimei said that a lot of people did not show up, uh, which is very unfortunate. Uh, I guess a lot of people couldn't make it, you know, um, and it's amazing. Dave had a lot of fans, a lot of viewers, a lot of subscribers, um, but I guess a very small uh, family. So um, I didn't get to meet anybody, unfortunately, uh, but Patricia was here. I believe with her granddaughter and her, um, I guess her, maybe her daughter and her husband. Um, and there was someone here from the radio station. Um, so it was a small service and of course I was supposed to be there. There was no pasture or anything like that, which is really sad. Um, but we're gonna go over there right now um, and I'll show you guys where it's located. Now this is really ironic and weird. Um, Shemay actually pointed this out to me um, this road is, is Hughes. Um, we're known, we're near the section we were at before, but, uh, we're going to turn down Hughes and Dave's graves along this side here. There's another road here on the side and we're going to park right, right here and go to his grave. I literally got to the grave site, um, as they were just finished covering up the box here um, of his uh, cremated ashes 
and there is no headstone for Dave specifically, which is understandable. Usually at this point, there is not a stone for somebody when, you know, you weren't expected to pass. And they did a really good job over here with the, the grass, so it might take me a second. I might come back to you guys if I don't find it right away. I want to say it was down this row here. All right, just found uh, found his grave. It's over here. It took me a second. It's very, very close to the road, so it should be pretty easy to find. Oh, gosh. Heartbreaking. So, this is, uh, this is Dave's grave. This is where he is. So, um, Richard, which is, I believe, his father, who died in 91. Looks like Sarah, who's his mother, died in uh, 2004. Someone brought a nice uh, bouquet here, and... Uh, this patch of soil right here is Dave's final resting place. And I'm sorry if I'm shaky, it's a little emotional. And this is for all you guys that couldn't be here today. Rest in peace, buddy. We love you. We love you, man. Rest in peace.